All right, guys, we are here with Mr. Mike Magazoo. Uh, I have had the honor and privilege of uh, going through the impact events with, with Mike in the past. Uh, we were actually bunk mates, uh, had some really great conversations uh, while we were at impact. And I am so excited for him to have accepted the invite to come here and share his insight story with us today. Mike, thank you so much for being here, man. I really appreciate it. Oh, well, thanks for well, uh, inviting me, Matt. You know, it's my pleasure. Well, before we really start getting into, like, insight in and of itself, can you take a minute and just kind of tell us a little bit about yourself and who you are, where you're from, all that kind of good stuff? Yeah, um, you know, j just to put it all as brief as I can, I grew up in the Northeast, just outside of Philadelphia. And then uh, uh, right after I got out of high school, my dad was working for a chemical company, which uh, put us into South Mississippi, which was a culture shock for me. And then uh, eventually uh, I moved into the Mobile, Alabama area. And uh, I was actually working as a pipe fitter helper and worked my way up through the ranks through supervision and then got into quality assurance. And uh, that led me to working for an engineering company and uh, I've worked for several engineering companies. I'm uh, a subject matter expert with respect to welding, fabrication, and, and that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, been, it's been quite a journey. I can imagine. And with all of that that you've done in, in that career and, you know, down that sort of life path, how did you end up at the Inside event with Entre? This is how I've always, this has always been my core beliefs, Matt, that there's always room for improvement. Um, I kind of learned from a relative at a young age that it's up to you whether you're going to succeed or not. And it's also up to you uh, what, what, what thoughts you choose. So, um, like I said, I, you know, I went through the ranks and I continually improved, got a little bit better each time I had an assignment. Uh, which, you know, for somebody with a high school education and then some additional education, you know, I felt like I did very well for myself. And then uh, I've actually been to uh, actually the American Welding Society headquarters down in Miami. And uh, because they chose me to be the chairman for the chapter in Mobile, Alabama. So that was a great opportunity. And one of the things that I tried to do was try to impress on, impress on some of the welding students um, you know, how, how you can take that career and just keep building better, 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 and it can take another path for you that's going to provide for you monetarily as well as, you know, your own uh, self-gratification as, you know, as far as succeeding in a career. So my journey to Insight uh, came along, it was uh, about, uh, August would have been a year ago, and uh I was actively seeking something to uh, help me improve myself. And when I found Entra, they also had the Insight program. And to me, that was a must-do thing. Um, even though I've read a lot of books and listened to a lot of audio books on human behavior and psychology and personality uh personalities in general because i love to watch people and i love to interact with them and, and try to figure out you know what, what are the noodles warming up in the noggin or aren't they you know that's that's basically it and uh so when i found out about insight um i was all in i said you know this is another opportunity for me to take my personal life to a different level uh, I had never been to like a Tony Robbins or a Robert Kiyosaki or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, so when I found out about Insight, uh, like I said, I jumped both feet in. So let me ask this question then. How, how was Insight presented to you? What was it presented as? Uh, to me, it was presented as a way to kind of get through your fears how okay. to build on your own personality and how to continually improve, you know, okay. that, that it was, uh, 
you know, that first step in taking a life path that uh, is going to help you to improve within. Got it. So you, you're you presented with this opportunity to go to Insight. You take advantage of it, and then you get to Insight. Describe for me the experience that you had while you were there. I really didn't know what to expect. Uh, so, okay. you know, it, 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 it was like one of those times when you, you walk into the, the – when you're registering there at the hotel and you, you kind of throw up in your mouth and say, what have I got myself into, you know? And uh, But the whole experience, the entire staff was just wonderful the night before. And then there was so much in-depth, uh, heavily, heavily condensed things about our thought patterns, our self-limiting beliefs, um, our fears, you know, how, you know, how it, we have to just keep on pushing to push through our fears. Uh, the entire experience was one that um, was unique and that I'd never been to one that was so condensed, but it was also uh, very self-rewarding in that, um, you know, I've, I've noticed changes in myself of uh, how much I've improved as far as my temperament, uh, which, you know, I, of course, as you get older, that kind of calms down. But as a young man, you know, I was you know, pretty raw when, when it came down to temperament. And uh, it's really kind of helped me with that. It's helped me to release some things that I really need to release from my formative years. Um, and it really helped me push through that as well as, uh, you know, other parts of my life. So if a year and a half ago, someone said to you, that you'd be right where you are right now, what would you have said to them? I said, there's no way. I'm just going to keep, <laughs> I'm just going to keep going to work for the engineering company, go do my welding inspection. And, you know, that's it. Uh, my whole thought patterns have become much more positive, uh, uh, much more uh, likely to encourage others to improve themselves. Uh, and, and, and my whole, uh, my whole dialogue has gotten much better, uh, when dealing with people and when, uh, helping them see things of how life affects us and you can mm -hmm. either let it get you down or you can understand it and step forward. That's amazing. And it's, it's, it's honestly, it's very similar to the stories that, the other people I've spoken to have had and just how, how just transformative, how, how, how you changed, not just, you know, uh, parts of you, but you, it's almost as though your whole being, you know, you, you mm -hmm. come in caterpillar and butterfly, you know, you come in the caterpillar, you leave the butterfly. I mean, and right. it's done in three days. <laughs> right, right. Condensed, it is condensed. You are doing a lot over yes. the course of that three days. Yes. And it's yes. it's amazing not only to see kind of the the, the the transformation within yourself, but to see that transformation in all the people around you as well. Like yeah. and to know that this is what's coming out of all of this is going yeah. out into the world. Yeah. Yeah. And and uh uh I mentioned that uh, one of the guys that was in uh, the group that I was with, mm -hmm. Matt, it has been amazing to see how much growth he has had. And uh, he, he, he spends more time with his family. I, I'm single. So, you know, I don't have kids that I'm raising. I don't have a wife, you know, but it's amazing to see how he has changed. And it's so encouraging to see that, that, he has such a better relationship with his children. And then uh, one of the other uh, ladies in the group, um, her husband just recently attended Insight. And I can see that those two are communicating so much better now. Not that they probably had any problems, but, right. you know, problems as far as any kind of friction. But it, it, it's just so evident how closer they are now. 
That's amazing. That that is absolutely amazing. So and and you just mentioned that you know one went before the other. In in your estimation, when it comes to encouraging someone or finding you know a certain element or uh, you know trying to figure out who might potentially benefit from going to insight in your mind who is or what is the kind of person that should or would be benefited greatly by going to the inside experience i don't know a person on the face of this earth matt that isn't looking for something better <laughs> and the best place to start that is from within so anybody that's looking for a few answers and, and a clear direction of where they want to go, it will put them on a trajectory to a better life within themselves. So I, I, I feel like it's for everybody. Mm -hmm. The value of it is extremely high. Um, you know, just based, you know, on, on the event itself, the value is high. Um, you know, and, and the experience and, and being able to, uh, you know, make, make that next step and improve w within, in yourself. And, and, you know, if, if, if more people had that mindset and that mental approach of, well, I can improve myself, well, then it's going to be, they are going to be a reflection of everybody around them. What is it they say? You're the you're the average of the five people that you hang around with most. Absolutely, yeah. Could you, you imagine you, everybody yeah. that you know that you hang out with have gone through that experience? Yeah, just yeah. The, yeah. the energy, the the connectivity, the right the potential. Right. Honestly, right. Yeah, and then and, and you've got five friends, and then they've got five friends, and next yeah. thing you know, we'll take over the world. <laughs> yeah. And, 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 you know, just, just by applying some of the, the, the core benefits of, of, uh, Todd's teachings and, you know, what he teaches us, uh, you can improve so much, but it takes that effort in applying them and really listening to what he's saying. If you're going to go there and say, well, this doesn't apply to me, then you're not in the right mind. And a hundred percent. And you go in with a with a completely open mind, and you touched on something there uh, towards the end as well. In that, this work is not go to Denver for three days, and then you're done. You like you're tra you're changed, you're transformed, and then you're done. It's no, you you go, you go through the experience, you learn the tools. You come out transformed, and then you go out into the world and you apply them. And that is one of the things that's fundamentally different, I think, personally, about this kind of uh, this kind of event versus some of the others that you mentioned earlier, in terms of you know a Tony Robbins or a, a Robert Kiyosaki or something like that. Like it's it's actively participating in the work long after. You come home from Denver, right? Yeah, and I—I I mean, I, I assume this for you, but I, I find the work to be very enjoyable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I mean, yeah. it's 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 improved my life in so many different ways. Clearly, it's improved yours in so many as well. Uh, the the goal for all of these discussions that that I've been having is to is to really just spread the word. Right. And I, I, I truly believe that, to your point, if everyone can go, this world would be a completely different place, man. Completely, completely different. different. You know, and, and, and I saw, uh, actually, when I attended, there was a couple of younger people. Uh, I think the youngest was 17, and I think the other one was probably 18 or 19. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking to myself, how good would it have been to have the tools and in the mindset you know when when i was that age you right. know because it's it's like you know your your parents do the best they can and give you what they know 
But to be able to benefit from something like that at such a much younger age is just phenomenal. And again, to, to be, you know, I, I'm actually envious of them too, because of, not just because of their age, but to have been of the right mindset to go in. Again, I remember when I, when I was like, as a teenager, that would not have been the right time for me. I would not have been open to it, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> I was just, uh, my brain was on other things at that time. Right. But right. It's, it, it's, it's truly amazing to see the, the maturity of these kids. And I call them kids because I'm 45 years old and I can't. That go into these things and, and you see it just along with the, the guys our age and older and younger, like they're right there with it. They're having a similar experience and they're getting the benefit the way everybody else is. So the, the, the process is, is universal and it can happen at any point of time in your life. You're just better off if you do it sooner rather than later. Right, right. Yeah, and it, uh, I'll say this about the way the the event itself was facilitated. Yeah. It was uh, it was in bite sized form, so that you could absorb the energy and you could absorb the benefit of it. It wasn't, I don't think, over anybody's head, but it was presented in such a uh, bite sized session that you could stay right with it it was to me it was captivating uh you know that there there were so many times that i was torn between just sit there and listen or take more notes you know uh it, it, it was just a wonderful event i i i could i've never been able to to really place that aspect of it but the word that you just used captivating mm -hmm. is that I, that's how i felt Granted, there was it was a bit of a roller coaster ride, but for the most part, it was just enthralled and captivated by what was going on around us. And again, just going through all of that and seeing what seeing the benefit of of the work and and what it's done for all of these people, because I we both still keep in contact with people that we know that have gone to Insight and just seeing how that change has stayed with them because they continue the work. This is right. transformative, life-changing stuff that everybody needs to go to. I don't know that yeah. we've said that enough. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, you, you, if, you, if you had to drag them in there, I think we both would do it. <laughs> I, I, 100%. 100%. Mike, thank you so much for your time, man. I really appreciate it. This has been a great conversation. Um, I, I'm so glad that you're doing so well and that, you know, life is just opening up for you. Um, if there's ever anything that I can do for you, please let me know. I really appreciate the time, man. And back at you, Matt. It was good visiting with you, and you have a great evening. Thank you, sir. You too.